So this is one topic that I wanted to talk about for some time now and I finally <laughs> got up and stopped procrastinating to record this video. So one thing that's really underrated in terms of achieving success and being more motivated, having a better mindset and everything is actually listening to music. So uh, most of the people like even uh, some successful entrepreneurs, some successful millionaires, they say like, uh, oh, don't waste the time listening to music. Even while you are working out, you can literally listen to podcasts, uh, ebooks, and uh, stuff like that. You can literally uh, listen to audiobooks while working out, and you n should never listen to music. It's a waste of time. Here's why I disagree. So, you can technically listen to audiobooks uh, or podcasts while you are working out and stuff like that. You can to you can avoid music for the rest of your life, but you shouldn't do it. Uh, because the first thing is that uh, when you are working out, if you find music that's really motivating to you, that's really making you like get uh, get the energy, get the motivation, get the drive. Uh, if you have music like that, like for me, uh, it's some uh, rock music or electronic music or something like that. You maybe prefer maybe rap or whatever. So you find music that motivates you. And when you listen to that music while working out, you can get like a 20% boost in performance. And I'm not even joking. So if I wanted to do a workout without music and do a workout with music, the difference is huge, like at least 20%. And not only this, the bigger difference comes from the second thing I will talk about now. And that's the mindset. That's the subconscious mind. So your subconscious mind is always listening. And uh, sometimes if you even don't even think about the lyrics of a song, they may get ingrained into your uh, mind. Like sometimes you may uh, felt it like when you have a song in your mind that's repeating itself and you didn't even listen to the lyrics, like you didn't even pay attention. Uh, but you don't need to pay attention to something to uh, for it to get into your subconscious mind. So uh, what happens is that like a year ago, I was listening to Blackpink. Like I was listening to some K-pop uh, k-pop crap and stuff like that uh, and uh, the thing is i was technically doing some good workouts but i wasn't really killing workouts and my i was like a soy boy like i was listening to k-pop like korean girls like <laughs> you can't even take this seriously but uh, the thing is when i changed that and started listening to maybe imagine dragons uh, ashes remain uh, three Days Grace, um, Thousand Foot Crutch, uh, and some of the songs from like like Rocky movies or something like that. When I started listening to those music, um, my mindset started changing. Uh, I became more masculine. I think even my testosterone went up. My workouts got better. I started noticing more progress. I was more motivated. I was more inspired. I felt better. I was less of a simp. And a lot of things had changed just from that. So really, uh, music is uh, much more important than some people think. So definitely, music is not a waste of time if you listen to right music. So find music that has inspiring and motivating lyrics. Find music that motivates you. Find music that isn't crap. And like uh, people will say, uh, don't insult anyone. Uh, music is subjective, like uh, everyone has their uh, favorite music and stuff like that. Okay, that's fair enough. You don't have to listen to rock or electronic music, but you will find music that doesn't have shitty lyrics. Like, because if music has shitty lyrics and is uh, something like BS, uh, it will negatively impact your uh, subconscious mind. So if you only love uh, BS music, like the music that's now popular in the West, don't do it. Like, then listen to audiobooks or podcasts. But... If you are able to find some songs that are like, I don't know which examples to give, like, uh, you can search for like songs like uh, maybe Ashes Remain On My Own, Ashes Remain uh, Rise, uh, you have like Thousand Foot Crutch, War of Change, you have like Whatever It Takes by Imagine Dragons, you have Believer by Imagine Dragons, you have like some of these songs, you can listen to like uh, Burning Heart and um, Eye of the Tiger from Rocky movies. You can listen to uh, all kinds of different songs like these. Uh, and mostly uh, all of these songs have uh, great lyrics. 
uh, strong lyrics that can motivate you and affect your mind in a good way. So definitely uh, listen to music if it's uh, good music, li music like this, so you maybe don't like it. But um, songs like these definitely impact you positively because of the lyrics. Your subconscious mind is always listening, as I said. And definitely these songs with these strong lyrics, they will impact you positively, your mind, and you will also crush workouts. And you don't even need to listen to these only while working out. I'm listening to some of these songs when I'm doing some work that doesn't require um, real focus. So, really, I'm repeating it again. Definitely, you need to listen to these songs that make sense. And yeah, this was quite an unfiltered video. I don't uh, feel like I have to edit anything here. It's just like a strong message that I had for you guys. From my own experience, like I was on the both sides. I was listening to crap and now I'm listening to nice songs like lyrics. If you read, if you read the lyrics of the song, whatever it takes by Imagine Dragons, like literally if you read the lyrics, I mean, it's flipped probably on the screen, but if you read the lyrics, like they are so fucking inspiring and motivating. You, they make you want to crush everything. Like uh, these lyrics, you want these kinds of lyrics. You don't want lyrics like something like talking about bitches or simping or something like that. You don't want lyrics like that, like those. You, you want lyrics like these. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Nothing too much to tell you. Like if you agree, disagree, you can leave a comment below, but that's pretty much it. You can use music to help you succeed. As simple as that. See ya guys.